Yo, y'all, y'all see this box of Capri Sun I got right here? Am I the only one that just figured this out today, or maybe I'm an uncultured piece of shit, or maybe I'm just straight up an idiot? Like, there's a lot of things that could be, but they open like this? What? I'm gonna share the most important thing I have ever posted on the internet. This is a normal size mug. This is a slightly larger mug. See the difference? And many of you will ask, why is this important? Keep your hands warm. So I'm not claiming to be a genius or anything, but I do want to let you guys know that I have a lot of great ideas that I think, I think could turn into something, something good, you know? Okay, so I hope I'm not like the only human on the planet to not know this, but a while back my dad came over and was watching me do laundry, and if you use this kind of soap that dispenses down into this little cup, you know, it's really convenient, but it sucks when you pour it out because all the stuff gets stuck on the inside. My dad, my dad said to me, you know, you can just throw the whole cup in there. I'm like, what do you mean? I always pour it all in there. And he's like, no, just throw the whole cup in the washer. And then it washes itself. First things first, you get the saran wrap. Next, you get the peanut butter. And you smear it on the saran wrap. This peanut butter does not have xylitol before I, all y'all freak out. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> dork. <laughs> oh, I look like a dork. I'm about to look like a genius. Hey, and look, right like, here. I would never do look this. right here. It, it was, oh, not oh that's some good stuff. You know, I figured I'd run it together. No, that's good. I can't see my life. No, that's good stuff. Day, yeah, boy. Hoping to be released on time. What's up? Good. 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 You don't get any because you won't let me. <gasps> Wait, that's good. So I think I'm the only person that didn't know this, but if you have a Yeti, the little top is magnetic so you can clean underneath it. All right, so this is probably one of the best kept secrets for solving the Rubik's Cube. I almost considered not sharing this with you guys because it kind of takes the fun out of it, but I figured, I don't know, maybe you could use it to like get a date or impress your friends or something. So anyways, uh, here goes. You can solve any Rubik's Cube starting in any position using just two moves, and you're just gonna repeat these moves over and over again. You're gonna turn the left side counterclockwise, and then you're gonna turn the top clockwise so it looks like this and you're just going to keep on repeating this sequence over and over again and eventually the cube will start to sort of solve itself you just keep going sometimes it takes a little longer than others pretty simple for everybody asking how I rip the apple in half 
it's really not that hard. It doesn't take big old muscles or anything. All you do is you look at the top of the apple and you find its line like this. This is my line of my apple. Okay, I prefer this hold. It's kind of like this part of my hand on the top, fingertips over here. And then from there, you just start to peel and you can rip it right in half. And it makes a perfect slit and then you can eat it. That's all it takes. Okay, so I wanted to show you a quick little trick to displaying fruit on your board. Halve an orange and then cut it into equal slices. Then do the same with a green apple. Now interleave the slices. When it's finished, it not only looks really gorgeous, but the orange against the apple keeps it from going brown. So pop that on your board next time you're putting one together. Okay, so legit, I just found out, just now, you can peel both directions. What have I been doing? <laughs> My mom was today years old when she found out this was a straw. <laughs> okay, I was today years old. No one told me, no one, until TikTok. That my acne medicine helps with wrinkles. Apparently all you have to do is mix it with an eye cream and stay 23 forever. The derm forgot to mention that one. Oh my gosh, guys. So I was today's years old when I found out that you can actually use the search bar in Snapchat memories. Like, do you know how many times I've spent scrolling through trying to find a certain thing? So I seen a message that says, how old were you when you find out if you text someone pew pew with an iPhone? It's the latest show. So let's see. So here's my friend. I sent them. Let's see it. What? Hey, well, I'm getting ready to re-season my pan because it's got a little rough spots in the inside and I want to show y'all how to do this. Basically, I washed it with a little soap and water and you typically don't put soap on these pans, but I did it for this just to clean it real good. And I took a paper towel and just ran a uh, vegetable oil through it, front and back, the handle and everything. And all you do is set your oven on 350. My oven is coming up to 350 right now. You put a pan or some aluminum foil in the bottom of your oven, and then you just turn it upside down like so. And you let it sit in that oven on 350 for an hour. And then after it sits in the oven on 350 for an hour, you turn the oven off and you let it cool completely in the oven. That's how you season a cast iron pan. That's how you keep a cast iron pan alive. It will last you a lifetime. Hey guys, look how big this pillowcase is. Most people would just tuck it over and throw it like that and think it looks fucking great. Well, come up here, Blaze. I want to get a close up. Come over to this side too. Basically, you're gonna put your hand in the pillowcase. You're gonna pull it here. You're going to tuck, 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 so that the material gets tucked all the way in there. You're going to straighten it out just like this. And doesn't that look much better? Done. Today, I'm FaceTiming one of my friends, and while we're FaceTiming, he switches the direction of his fan to heat his room in the winter. I've been suffering for six years, and I just now realized my fuck up today. Well, I immediately get up and get on top of my bed like this, and I look, look at this. I have a pro tip for you. Do you want to know how to get all the sauce? to the top of the bottle, hold it like this, and then swing it around like you're about to pitch for like the Yankees, like this. And then all of the sauce will go down to the bottom. Centrifugal force.
you make art on Snapchat? And then you can add an emoji. my gosh, look at her butt. Oh my gosh, look at her butt. Oh my gosh, look at her butt.